वेलकम बैक टू एम एल टी वर्ल्ड टूडे फ्रेंड्स आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर यू हाउ टू डायलूट द कैलिब्रेटर्स एंड कंट्रोल इन लेबॉर्टरी वैन द कंट्रोल एंड कैलिब्रेटर्स आर कमिंग इन लाइफोलाइज फॉर्म नॉर्मली वैन इट इज़ इन लाइफोलाइज फॉर्म वी हैव टू स्टोर एंड टू टू एट डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड एंड जस्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल चेक दैट यू हैव टू डायलूट योर कंट्रोल और कैलिब्रेटर विद डिजिटल वाटर और बिकॉज समाइम डायलूंट इज कमिंग विद द किट ऑल्सो and then bring the control and calibrator at room temperature first of all and after that we will dilute with distilled water and we have will check that how much ml need water or diluent for dilution as i told we will use distilled water if you have already distilled water machine and you are collecting water then you can use that otherwise this this sterile distilled water injections are also available 10 ml that also we can use Uh, but we will not take water directly from this injection water first we will dispense this injection water into centrifuge tube for the correct pipetting otherwise your pipetting will not be accurate and if dilution will not come accurate your calibration will not be uh, accurate or it will not it will not be completed so uh, as now what we required further we required 1 ml pipet and blue tip we then we will dispense first we will dispense this injection water in centrifuge tubes and then we will check in each tube in each vial how much ml water need to added if you have any other uh, tube uh, you can dispense in that also just for the correct pipetting we need a proper container now first of all this is the standard and i will show you how much water we have to add in this i think 1 ml water we have to add and uh, just i will try i am trying to show you just wait you see here it's written so always check the vial that which type of diluent need to add and how much quantity need to add and the other important thing when you are doing pipetting when you are aspirating that time keep the pipet straight and when you are dispensing keep your 45 angle to avoid the bubbles and when we will add the water at least need 20 minutes to mix properly in between you can just mix little and keep straight keep mix little keep straight but give 20 minutes time at least for the exact mixing and once you confirm that uh, the diluent is mixed properly then also then only start calibration or control running and just write the date because uh, after uh, when we will prepare this uh, control where because when before they were in lifeolize form and after adding water now they are ready to use so but we have to see that after dilution how many days we can use this calibrator just read the kit literature it is mentioned that after dilution for how many days you can use your control and calibrator so for that reason you must write date now important thing is once you will dilute your control or calibrator then you after running calibration or control keep your control and calibrator in freezer minus 20 degree centigrade when it was in lifeolize form that time we have to keep in fridge but once it is ready to use after use we will keep in minus 20 degree centigrade and then just check the literature that in minus 20 degree centigrade how many days we can use our control and calibrator i hope in this video you understand how to prepare the control and calibrators and if you like this video press like button also if you want to know about any other topic please write in comment box and do not forget to give me the best gift that is your subscription if you still not subscribe the channel please subscribe and if you not still share this channel to your friend do share also thank you so much